Hi, this is a Git uh, basis to the path flow. And uh, today I will show you how to undo the commit. For example, uh, when uh, you type the wrong uh, message in the commit and you want to uh, amend it, or you are uh, making a commit into the wrong uh, branch and uh, you want to uh, undo it. For doing this undo, uh, we have few com commands in the GIF uh, to let you do this undo. First is the uh, amend, uh, and the uh, cherry pit and the uh, reset, uh, ref rock and uh, reverse. Uh, this is the four type of uh, undo command and I'm going to show you for today. Uh, first, uh, I will show you the what is a man. And here uh, we have this uh, master branch uh, with the initial commit. It's a AAA12BC. For example, we are adding a new file in index.html in the working uh, area and we commit it. Uh, we add it to the staging area and we made a commit. But actually, we don't want this uh, commit we don't want this a uh, new commit, we want this uh, index.html to be the same commit as in the initial commit in the AAA12BC. So after uh, we add the chain to the staging area, we can type it, we can use the amend to uh, amend this uh, chain back to the previous uh, commit by typing the that's, that's amend. And it will uh, move this uh, chain uh, back into the uh, previous commit. But the problem is, and you see that the our um, initial commit is the AAA12BC, but after we amend, the git will assign a new ID to this uh, initial commit. It means we are changing the history. Problem is uh, when this project is uh, working uh, work in the group, and other member might have this uh, history ID. So if you change the history ID, it might be a problem for the other member. So I will show you how to uh, remain uh, this ID after the undo uh, at the end of this video. So first, uh, let's... Uh, Continue uh, the cherry pit. This is a cherry pit uh, is to let you uh, uh, undo the commit on the ROM branch. So, for example, you commit the chain to the master branch, but actually you want them to be in the other branch. So, we can use this uh, cherry pit. So, let's see an example here. So, first, uh, as usual, we had this uh, initial commit and uh, we made the we added this uh, index HTML to the working area and we add to the staging state and after that we commit. It, but now it's the, we have commit the, uh, this one in index.html uh, into this master branch. But actually, we want to to have uh, this uh, commit on the other branch. For example, we now create this uh, w branch. And first, uh, you need uh, to check out into this uh, w branch first. After that, we can uh, use this uh, cherry piece. So you type this cherry piece followed by this uh, commit that you want to bring over. So the ID is bbb 10 a but the problem is the same at the amend. After you bring this uh, commit from the master branch into this uh, the branch, the, the hash ID, the history will change. So now, after you uh, do this cherry pitch, you bring the commit into the, the root branch, but the previous uh, commit is still remain in the master branch, and we need to remove uh, this uh, commit from the master branch as well. So we can uh, use the reset uh, command there are three types of reset you can you can use one is a reset soft a reset soft will bring back this uh, bring back this commit to the staging area and another one is the reset default you just type reset followed by this id and this one will bring the the chain back to the working area then the last one is the reset hard this reset hard is a we reset and totally clear the chain from uh clear everything from the master branch. So next, uh, we show you how to use this uh, reference rod. By typing this reference rod, uh, it will the git will list out all the chain, all the history chain, uh, for you. For example, just now we have, we have you the reset to uh delete out the commit or bbb one zero aa. So you can uh, bring it back by typing a checkup bbb 10 aa and it will bring back this uh, commit to the master branch again. So next, I will show you how to uh, use the reverse. Just now I told you that key also can help you do the undo. Uh, we are changing the history. Uh, this is the one related to the, uh, the uh, HR uh, example in this uh, terminal here. So in the project file, I can right click and bring out this uh, terminal. And I uh, create this uh, uh, local repository first in this uh, for, uh, project folder and for example I create a file 
uh, for this uh, initial commit. For example, I create this uh, uh, in offer, and I add it to the staging area, and I make the commit. I say this is the initial commit. So we have this uh, initial commit. So next, uh, try let me create another file so for us to do the uh, amend. So I create a uh, index so HTML file and I add it to the staging area. Let's check this uh, status. Now we are in this uh, staging area and I want this uh, chain to be put into this uh, initial commit so I can type the uh, commit that's, that's amend. And if we're going to open now this uh, default editor for you to type uh, to, to edit the uh, for you to edit this uh, command for example now you open out this initial co commit you can uh, change the commit or you just uh, cross this uh, editor and now our let's uh, check this uh, log you can uh, use this uh, that test uh, stats to uh, see the the file inside the the commit so this is our initial commit well, we only have one commit here and you can see that uh, you, you already uh, changed the ID and it's put in the, the initial commit we had done uh, before is uh, only for this uh, git in all file but now you add this uh, index.html uh, into this uh, same initial commit as well so we had done this uh, amend so another uh, another thing that you can do with this uh, amend is that uh, you can amend the, the command for example I <clears throat> let me uh, put in uh, some uh, content into this uh, index the HTML and uh, add to the staging area and make the call commit and for example I type the title uh, if I type the command said I maybe I type, type in the wrong uh, command for example I said I add file but actually it's uh, not adding any, any file here so let's See that we have a two com commit here. This initial commit and this uh, the new uh, commit we have made just now. So, and I want you to see, uh, to see that this uh, ID is a uh, cff 6 e So with with the wrong command. So you can uh, amend this command by typing a uh, git commit uh, dash dash amend dash m and put in the 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 right command here. The new command. For example, I said uh, uh Add co command, add content into index. And if I press enter, and you can see that it's assigned a new uh, has ID for you. And this ID, it will remove out and replace by this ID. For example, now I uh, type this error again, and you can see you already changed it from this ID into this ID. This is what I mean by the changing the history. Right, maybe other members still are holding this uh, ID in their uh, uh, local repository. So next, I want to show you how to uh, do the undo for the commit that you will uh, do the mistake by putting this commit in the wrong branch. Okay, now uh, let's see how this uh, cherry pit uh, help you to uh, relocate the commit into the other branch. So first, uh, let's check the current uh, commit that we have. Uh, here we have the uh, two commit, uh, initial commit and the other content into the index. And first, uh, we need to create a branch. So I use this uh, git branch. Let's check the current branch. Now we only have this master branch here. So to create a branch, we type git branch followed by the name of the branch. I call this one a DB for the develop. So now uh, we have uh, this uh, master branch and the develop branch. And first, in the master branch, I made uh, another commit. So let me create another file called uh, site.js and add to the staging area and commit to this. Uh, master branch uh, repository and, uh, and, uh, and site.js so let's check now we have this uh, three commit here now I want to uh, move this uh, commit into the, the group branch now it's on the this, uh, master branch here so now I type the uh, checkout to the group and you can see that this site.js uh, file will disappear after I uh, check into this uh, the group branch and I can uh, list out the file in this uh, the group branch and I only had this uh, index.html because it was created before I created this branch so it will list out this file for me so next thing is I want to bring uh, let's uh, go to this one again so next thing I want to uh, uh, bring this one into the different branch so I type uh, git 
cherry pit followed by this id b at c00 enter and now this file has been uh, returned back into the the group branch so now i can see this file but uh it go back to here again and you can see now we have uh, two uh copy or this uh, commit one is the default one in the master branch and one is the new one that we have uh, bring to this uh, the blue branch the sign uh, commit with this one the same command here so the next thing next step we want to do is to remove this one from the master branch so let's uh, check out into the master branch and let's check this one again and now i can uh, use the reset soft or reset default or reset hard so I can type the uh, git reset. Uh, let's try this one first. So using the uh, ID before this commit. So it's this one. So I need to type this uh, 2 ec 5 And now if I go back to this error again, and you can see it's already uh, removed out this uh, commit. And uh, you can see that this commit has been uh, removed out from the, the list of the commit here. So, but the problem is if I type status that's s in the master branch, we have this uh, site.js file, this one, in the staging area because we are using this uh, reset soft. It brings the, uh, the, the chain back to the staging area. If now I use the reset, uh, reset default, let uh, open up this one again and let me use this uh, reset. Okay, reset. Uh, you can uh, just uh, type in this ID uh, because it's a default. So I type 2ec05. And now I type the status again, and you can see that it go back to the working area. And to remove this uh, file, you can uh, use the uh, git clean, followed by the dash d for the directory and f for all the file. This, this command is to clean out all the untreated directory and untreated file. And this is the untreated file. So you can use this uh, command to uh, delete out this uh, untreated file after you use the reset default, or you can use the reset uh, hub followed by this uh, ID. You also will uh, uh, remove out this uh, file. Uh, let's try the git clean sdf. And now I type the status again, and you can see it's clean now. So now next, I want to uh, make uh, one uh, demo for this uh, reset hub. So let's go back to here again. Let me uh, create another uh, file again. And this time I try to create this uh, uh, CSS file and I add and commit to the editor uh, star. Add this file, you can commit to this uh, master branch uh, local repository. So now I, I have this uh, storage file here. So let's check the list uh, log again. And we have uh, this. Uh, uh, this commit in the master branch. Now I want to move this one into the double root. I want to move this commit into the group branch. So I check up into the double root branch again and then type git uh, cherry pit and followed by the uh, this id. So it's this 9982. Uh, six, sorry, it's uh, 69982. Now let's check this uh, uh, log again, and now I want to uh, I want to remove this uh, head from the master branch because I will already already move this commit into this uh, the group branch here with the new ID. And you can see the command is the same, so I want to remove this one from the master branch. So in the master branch, I can type git reset uh, using the hard and followed by the this ID. This ID is the ID before this change, so I can. So I type uh, 2 ec 5 and now I check this log again and you can see now this uh, 6 9 s 2 b has been removed out from this, uh, this list here. So you now I type this uh, status desk and you can see it's clean. It means you already clean out all the unstrated file of this uh, commit by using uh, this uh, reset hub. So the next thing let, I want to show you is uh, how to uh, use this uh, ref log. For example, now if I type git ref uh, log, you can see this this uh, this commit that I have uh, removed out just now, it was uh, this out in this uh, log here. 
it will list out all the commit that I had done, even the one that I, I had removed out from the branch. It's uh, this one here. So from here, you can uh, bring back any branch that you want by using the this command, checkout, followed by the uh, ID. For example, I want to bring out bring back this one, uh, 69982. And let me... Uh, Check this log again, and you can see that I bring back this uh, uh, commit back to the master branch again. So this is the way you can uh, you the this one is look like your dustbin in your PC. You will keep this uh log. You will keep this uh all this uh log file maybe for another thirty days before you will remove out from your uh, local repository. So the final thing that I want to show you is how to use this uh, reverse to do the uh to undo the commit without change the history. I create another uh, project folder and with this uh, new uh, initial commit. Let's check this uh, log again. Now this is the initial commit. So now let me uh, create the index file again. Uh, and I add it to the staging area and I'm commit it to the local repository. And say the uh, edit uh, index.html. But now I Check this a lot again. I list two commit, but now I want to uh, delete this. Uh, I want to undo. I don't want this commit. I want to undo it. I want to delete out this uh, index.html. So what can I do is uh, I can use this uh, reverse. I can type give reverse followed by this uh, s id. So I can type at one nine d, and this one this one we're going to uh, remove out this file because uh, this commit is to add, add this uh, this file to the repository. For example, if I now I make another change. I said echo uh, for I put some content into uh, this. I I put some content into this uh, index file, and I add to the staging area and make another commit. Add our ABC into index. So now I have uh, this uh, a three command a uh, three commit here. So for example, I want to uh, revert this uh, uh command uh, uh this content ABC from this uh, index HTML file. I can uh, also can use this uh, give reverse revert followed by this uh, hash ID a zero three one d enter and you're waiting for this uh, default editor to open up and you can type this uh, command here so maybe I can say I uh, remove the, this uh, ABC from uh, this file I save and cross and uh, if I check the content in this uh, index uh, sorry give uh, Cat uh, index dot html and you can see there's, there's the content or abc have been removed out from the file so i check this a lot again and you can see uh the we the history is still there but we have uh, another uh, new commit to uh, undo the the action that we had done in this uh, index dot html file so this is the method or how to undo the commit without a change the history because the history is still there so other members can still can see the history here. I think that's all for today. So in the next video, I maybe I will show you how to uh, use the debate and compare to the members. So thank you very much.